If you service newer trucks, you may have come across ones equipped with a dual input IMS starter. This tech tip video will provide an overview of this unique starter and what you need to know to service it correctly. As you might suspect, the dual input IMS starter has two wiring connection inputs rather than one. These inputs provide both power and ground together. They give the vehicle control over the power flowing in and out of the IMS when it is energized. Also, be aware that these inputs are not polarity sensitive. That means the wiring connections are foolproof in assembly and service. In a single input IMS, you only need to provide power to the S terminal to energize the IMS. The ground side of the coil is already integrated into the design. But in a dual input IMS, both power and ground wires run to the starter to energize the IMS. So if you are servicing a newer Cummins powered Freightliner or Western Star vehicle, your first step should be to check if a single or dual input IMS is being used. If you notice two vehicle wires running to the IMS, this will alert you that the vehicle uses a dual input IMS. If you're servicing a vehicle with a dual input IMS starter, be sure to replace it with a dual input IMS and not a single input IMS starter. This will eliminate wiring issues and assure the vehicle is operating as designed. If you have questions about diagnostics, troubleshooting, or other technical issues, contact the Technical Support Center. You can also visit us online.